We're doing this one in monochrome. So I have this 50 F2 here and it has a problem. It doesn't focus to infinity, but you know what else it doesn't do is respond well to its aperture being closed down. And a way to check for this, as I will show in a close up in a second here, is close the aperture all the way down. And then you can kind of play with the bayonet on the back. Yeah. It's, um, it's not quite right, really. It feels kind of like you're dragging something through a little bit of lotion, maybe. Or it feels like just gravy and mashed potatoes wedging between it. It's kind of like a, you'll know it when you feel it. It definitely isn't right. But I, the fact that I can also see the bayonet returning really sluggishly, that's a good indicator. At least, you know, that I can tell. This is the first lens that I bought with it. And of course, it has the issue. Right down there at the bottom, you can kind of see it's starting to really leach out. And the discolored aperture blade right next to it there, yeah. That's a sign, man. Go me! And you can kind of look through the back of the film camera as well when the door is open here. And, you know, set it to a darker aperture, take a photo when there's no film in it, of course, and look through the film plane. And, uh, yeah, you, in my case, I could still see the aperture trying to close down when it was doing it, or it wasn't consistent with what I was actually doing or shooting with. This camera looks so good in black and white, doesn't it? But, you know, hopefully I don't have this problem on the new lens. We will see. Yeah. It's, it's annoying. It's a never-ending thing, isn't it?